Hi guys. Um, I was baptized Catholic in 1998. And my family went to school, went to church till I was about seven or eight. And every summer we would get involved in vacation, vacation Bible school. And we would do different things within the church. Um, when we stopped going, I really started to stray from God. And when I was away from Him, I had a lot of insecurities. Like, I didn't feel like I was very pretty. And I never felt like I was going to be good enough. So I put a lot of time into like, my hair, my makeup, and... I just kept, like, I was very positive with other people, but I was very, very negative with myself, and I just didn't like who I was on the outside. And I kept asking myself, like, how can God love me if I don't love myself? And freshman year of college came, and I got this really good group of friends in the dorms, and we started hanging out, and Samantha Donnellan, who was also in Connect, she was one of them, and freshman year, like, every Tuesday she would invite me to Connect, and I was always too busy, or had something else to do, and I don't know, I just, I just always had something else to do, and she would always ask me, and then sophomore year came, and only three of my friends came back from freshman year, and Sam was one of them, and she ended up being my roommate, and she's like, hey, they're doing this really cool thing where we eat dinner at the Herb's house, and I was like, okay, that sounds fun, and so I went, and I was like, oh my gosh, like, everybody here is so happy, and they're so, like, friendly, and they invited me in right away, and so I kept going back to Thursday night dinners with her, but I wasn't quite ready for Connect yet. So we kept going to the dinners to like find out why these people were so happy and like why they were so friendly. And then finally I was like, Sam, can I go to Connect with you? And she was like, yeah, totally, that will be amazing. And so I kept going to Connect, and I really liked what they were saying. And then they invited me on my first retreat, like this one, and they had a lot of talks. and. Just getting to know everybody and like hearing other people's testimonies, like after the first retreat, I just thought that it was right to make room for Jesus in my heart again. And I remember reading in Matthew chapter 6, like talking about, don't worry about tomorrow because tomorrow will worry about itself. And like, it also talks about like, you know, don't worry about clothes and all that stuff. So it's like, I don't need to worry about that stuff. Like God has it planned out for me and I don't need to worry about what I'm going to wear or how much makeup I'm going to put on. I can just you know, put my trust in God, and then the following December, I went to DCC, the Denver Christmas Conference, and I got to share my faith with two girls on 16th Street Mall, and I felt like I could really relate to these two girls, because I was really new at this too, so I was like, telling them, and I got to put like everything in perspective when I was talking to them, like, what God meant to me, and why I want him in my life, and after DCC, I was able to like look in the mirror and be like, I love myself. I love every part of myself. And the coolest thing is that God makes me feel beautiful every day. Yeah. Yeah. yeah.